Hey guys, what's up? Ikona here. Welcome to another mobile real video. So right now I am doing an a special coverage of Fort War in Kingdom 11 and this battle will be between the guild SGK guild and Glory guild. Yep, so the battle just started a while ago and currently the capital is under occupied by SGK guild so let's roam around the kingdom so the moonlit port is under control by GD GD guild and I believe this is a sister guild of guild glory also the iron shield fort is under control by GD GD guild the Rocky Fort is under control by GL Guild. Unicorn Fort is also under control by GL Guild. Also the Sunray Fort. The Salted Fort is under control by Rising Phoenix Guild. And this is the Guild of All Might. The Serpentine Fort is under control by GD GD Guild. And the Razor Claw Fort is under controlled by two RUS guild. This is a Russian guild. So let's go back to the capital. I thought before the guild glory has been disbanded already. But now apparently guild glory is back. And it's nice to know that this guild is back. Because for those who don't know. For those who don't know that guild glory is the first largest english guild in mobile real yep they are the first english guild in mobile real since kingdom one and they are one of the uh what they call this the rival guild of guild cxe guild cxe is the formidable guild before when mobile real is new the CXC guild is where Skyrim is the leader of that guild. If you remember Skyrim guys, he is one of the formidable player here in Mobile Real. But now I think Skyrim already quit the game. But yeah, Guild Glory and Skyrim are the rival guilds in Kingdom 1 before. So I am happy to see that Guild Glory is back and here is Fact TK, the leader of Guild Glory. Let's check the Guild Glory and see who are the members currently here in this guild. So here are the members of Guild Glory. I'll just try to remember if there are player or member here that I can still recall yeah, some of the members here are familiar to me this one Buddha I know he is an original member of Guild Glory some of the members Dirilik Dirilic is also one of the original members of Guild Glory and if I am not mistaken Devil, Alan Devil is also a member, original member of Guild Glory I know you know who is Alan Devil right? He is the one who created the line group for mobile real players So the Guild Glory has to 1 billion might player. So yeah, it's good to see that they are back. So here in Rocky Fort, I don't know if SGK and Rising Phoenix are allies, but it seems that I don't think so they are not allies maybe <laughs> so you can correct me guys if 
I am making any false statement here or wrong information. So, Jaro or Haro has 1 billion might from GL Guild. And GL Hooks is. Alright, <laughs> he attacked. I, I forget the name of that castle. But Hooks just attacked it. And yeah, the guy was random teleported because of the attack. Wow, he keeps on attacking SDK members here. Boom! <laughs> Hooks have 528 million and here we go guys the rally of Ganges Kong of SGK is now marching towards the capital and boom the rally of Ganges Kong is successful and now SGK guild have the capital and now SGK is reinforcing the capital let's roam around the kingdom and let's see for other rallies So right now we are waiting for the rally that will be coming from guild T2RUS and this is the rally leader Do Dobri Book and the rally of Dobri Book is now marching towards the Razor Fort, Razor Claw Fort and boom the rally failed. Rising Phoenix successfully defended the Razor Glow Fort and now they are going to change their in no 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 they are just reinforcing the Razor Glow Fort and yeah they might probably change the composition of the army inside the Razor Glow Fort after the attack of Dubri Vok. Alright, let's go to the other side of the fort. Oops, wrong. Maybe here. So here we are waiting for the rally. Maybe the rally initiator here is Pipi Lepu. So let's just wait. Maybe I should go back to the capital first. So here in the capital GL led by Pete. Wait, I can see the name of that castle because there are many players reinforcing his castle. His name is Pete Spar. Pete, Pete Spar. So he is the rally leader. He is the one initiating an assembly to rally the capital. And let's see if his rally will be successful and but before that the guild GDGD GD, led by Pinpon is now marching towards the capital and I believe they are double rallying the capital GL guild and GDGD GD guild because these two guilds from what I know they are ally allies they are allies right and now GDGD GD has the capital guys correct me if I am wrong right correct me if GL and GTGD GD are not allies because maybe there are changes already happened because as far as I know before when we are on the same kingdom I know GTGD GD is uh, ally guild of glory guild but of course that's before and it's been a long time so there might be some changes so if i am wrong correct me please <laughs> all right so Ganges kong is initiating a rally now okay let's roam around the other side of the kingdom to other forts 
So here in Unicorn Fort, we are still waiting for the rally from GL Guild, but Hook followed the Unicorn Fort, but it failed. So SGK is still holding the Unicorn Fort. And there are a lot of SDK members burning on the upper left side of your screen. Marcel and Amar. Okay, so Tempe of Guild Glory is the one initiating the rally. And Pek TK is here. He is the magistrate right now. And GL Pit Spar just cancelled his rally. Maybe because GDGD is still hold on. So maybe the rally of GL is just a backup just in case the rally of GDGD a while ago failed. But apparently GDGD rally was successful so they don't need to continue their rally their second rally from guild glory right so now haro of guild glory is initiating a rally maybe this will be the rally that will hit the capital just in case the rally of sgk become successful yeah, they are these two guilds, GDGD and Guild Glory, are tagging up. They are tagging up to defeat SGK here in this fourth war. There you go, the rally of Ganges Kong of SGK Guild is now marching towards the capital. And it failed again. GDGD still holds the capital, and most probably Haro, the rally of Haro, will will be cancelled, as it is just a backup rally. Okay, let's go back here. So the Razor Glow Fort is still under control by Rising Phoenix Guild, and I don't know. If 2 RUS guild is going to rally the Razor Glow Fort, I am not seeing any assembly from the side of 2 RUS guild. But Dillon is keep on scouting the Razor Glow Fort and members of Rising Phoenix guild. Maybe he is the one going to initiate an assembly to rally the Razor Claw for. Okay, let's roam again. So in Unicorn Fort, the SGK Guild recalled their armies from the Unicorn Fort. And yeah, they will just change the composition of their armies. And P. Lepu is now the rally leader in Unicorn Fort. They have to reinforce the Unicorn Fort pass because the rally of GL Guild might march any moment from now. Wow, Peck TK keeps on teleporting from different side of the forts. So Tempe Rally is now marching, but there's a glitch. We didn't see we are not seeing now the rally of Tempe and there you go, the rally is now showing up and 
Boom! GL Guild is now occupying the Unicorn Fort. Okay, let's go back to the capital. And here, wow, it seems SGK Guild already give up the capital as some of their members already ported out and there is only one SGK member left here, Esh. So yeah, maybe they already give up the capital to GDGD or JL Guild. So Ganges Kong teleported here in Iron Shield Fort. Maybe this is the one the Iron Shield Fort is the new target of their guild. And Ganges Kong is now receiving I believe reinforcement and he is most probably initiating an assembly now to rally the Iron Shield Fort. From the way it looks, it seems SDK is the underdog in this battle because there are two guilds that are teaming up the GDGD guild and the Glory guild SDK should have called their allies as well so that they can make a double rally just like what Get Glory and GDGD are doing. They have good coordination. Alright, so now Haro Rally is marching towards the capital, and it seems GDGD Guild is giving way for the capital. They are giving the capital to Guild Glory. Alright, let me check the Guild Glory Guild Board so we can confirm if GDGD is their allies. There is no indication here or description or any any the announcement that GDGD is their ally or family but what they say here is that we are trained professional to bully SGK and their Teletubbies friends <laughs> so they are really a rival or mortal enemies I hope my assume or my assumption is correct guys that GDGD and Guild Glory are allies but yeah maybe yeah I think I'm, I'm correct because look GDGD already gone in capital and they gave capital to Guild Glory so yeah I believe I'm right so here in Iron Shield Fort SGK Guild will try to, to steal ownership of the said fort from GDGD guild and Gangus Kong is the one initiating the assembly to rally the Iron Shield fort let's look at all the forts so there is still no forts belong to SGK here in Rocky Fort is already a, I can say it, this is already secured by Rising Phoenix Guild but here in Razor Glow Fort Rising Phoenix Guild and 2RUS is still fighting for the Razor Glow Fort but I am not seeing any rally coming from the 2RUS Oh no, there is the rally of 2RUS led by Dog Rebook and his rally just hit the Razor Claw Fort and 2RUS is now 
occupying the Razor Claw Fort. Alright, Harley Crew is here, a 1 billion might player. And here we go, the rally of Genghis Kong is now approaching the Iron Shield Fort. And let's see if he will be successful in this rally. And boom! SGK rally is successful and they now have the Iron Shield Fort. And with that guys, I will be leaving you again with this video. And I will be back after 1 to 2 hours. So yeah, just keep watching.
is 115 points over 120 points and currently GL Guild just need 5 more points in order for them to completely occupy the capital and the guild SGK already give up and yeah so we are now just waiting for GL Guild to completely occupy this capital we are just waiting for 5 more points and now they only need 3 more points so here is Fek TK of Guild GL and it's really kinda nostalgic seeing Guild Glory again because you know guys Guild Glory is one of the first guild here in Mobile Royale, Mobile Royale just like our guild LOBB and I'm kinda missing as well our guild LOBB and I hope one day our guild will reunite again but I don't know if that will be possible but yeah <laughs> enough for that Alright guys, so one more point and the capital will be declared officially under Guild Glory. And yeah, we are just waiting for the shield of capital to pop. And there you go, Guild Glory is now officially the ruler, again the ruler of Kingdom Eleven. Let's check also the other forts. Guild Glory also got the Unicorn Fort. They also got the Sunray Fort. While Guild GD GD got the Iron Shield Fort. The Moonlit Fort. And the Serpentine Fort. While Guild Rising Phoenix got the Rocky Fort. The Razor Claw Fort and uh, so to perform all right and sgk guild unfortunately they haven't got any fort in this battle because they really had time fighting against guild glory and gd gd guild because gl and gd gd guild is team or they team up to beat guild sgk so yeah SDK got defeated in this battle and guys if you haven't subscribed to my channel please hit the subscribe button on the left corner of your screen and help me reach my goal of 2000 subscribers all right so that's it for now guys if you like this video please give it a thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel as well. thank you so much for watching Bye.